Welcome to the first LEGO League Into Orbit season. Your crew will join thousands of teams around the world, embarking on a mission to explore, challenge, and innovate in the demanding and inspiring expanse we call space. There are three steps you should take before you get started. First, read the missions in the challenge and robot game rules in the challenge guide. Make sure you understand the constraints for the missions. If the rules don't clearly say something is illegal, it isn't. Next, as a team, identify one or more missions to solve. Pick the mission that looks the most fun, fascinating, or even easiest to perform consistently. You can always add more missions if you have time. Once you have selected a mission, design a robot using LEGO Mindstorms technology that can solve the mission. You may need to rewrite your code a few times and build a few different versions of your robot before it performs consistently. Don't worry, this is all part of the challenge. As you work with your team, keep the first core values in mind. You and your team members have many hidden talents and skills. Now let's take a tour of the Into Orbit missions. Remember, very few teams have time to do all the missions, so pick the ones that are the most fun and interesting to you and your team. Prioritize. The robot needs to send payload rockets rolling down the space travel ramp. The first cart is preset and ready to go, but the robot needs to load the other two from base. Start each payload clearly rolling down the space travel ramp. For each roll, the cart must be independent by the time it reaches the first track connection. Solar panels need to be angled toward or away from you, depending on strategy and conditions. The robot needs to get a regolith core sample and place it into the 3D printer, which will cause the 2x4 brick to pop out. The ejected 2x4 brick can then be delivered elsewhere for more points. The robot or whatever agent craft it sends out needs to cross the crater's model completely by driving directly over it, not near it, not around it. The robot needs to get all the core samples out of the core site model. Then it has options for what to do with them, as described here and in Mission 3. The robot needs to remove and insert modules among the Habitation Hub's portholes. Help our spacewalking astronaut Gerhard get to safety. The robot needs to get the astronaut's body into the airlock chamber. The robot needs to repeatedly move one or both of the exercise machine's handle assemblies to make the pointer advance. The robot needs to lift the strength bar to scoring height. Move the push bar the right distance at the right speed to get into the green scoring range.
The robot needs to impact the strike pad hard enough to keep the spacecraft from dropping back down. The robot needs to move one or more satellites to the outer orbit. Rotate the observatory to a precise direction. From west of the free line, send one or both meteoroids independently to the meteoroid catcher. If ever the ring set meteoroid is off its ring, you may remove the ring from the field by hand. This is a special exception to the rules. Get the lander to one of its targets intact, or at least get it to base. The lander is intact if its parts are connected by at least two of its four TAN location axles. First, LEGO League mission requirements need to be achieved by your robot through its programs and its use of equipment. You're allowed to hand rescue your robot, but that does cause this penalty. Be sure to pay extra attention to the rules where they talk about interruptions. If you interrupt the robot, you will lose three points each time. Upon penalty, the referee will place one penalty disc in the Southeast Triangle as a permanent interruption marker. You can get up to six such penalties. Remember to support each other through the season as you work together to solve these missions. Space travel can only be possible with teamwork and collaboration. Good luck, teams. We hope your season is out of this world. Into Orbit has been brought to you by our global sponsors, 3M, NI, Rockwell Automation, and, of course, LEGO.